Hello guys, and welcome to some Minecraft. I'm actually going to play Minecraft on my server. It's been a while, it's been quite a while. Uh, I've been meaning to go on here for quite a while, and I've always either ended up doing FTL because it doesn't take as long, or doing some other stuff, but texture glitch. Uh, but I have I booked tomorrow off work not to do this particularly but just because I'd already booked it off and it just coincided nicely so let's play some Minecraft I have no idea what episode this is don't even think it matters but let's right what I'm doing today is finding somewhere. Hello, doggy. Should I say Wolfie? As you know, this isn't Wolfie. This is doggy. Um, I am going to find somewhere to build a house. That is what I'm going to do. Whether I'll build the house today, I don't know. I'm not sure yet, but I'm going to find somewhere to find somewhere to build it. Right. So let's see here. So, let's go. I'm going to go to Carpet Bird because he said he was building a town. Whether those coordinates are the way to the town, I do not know. Ah, that's a lot of chickens. I'm going to go steal some chickens. Some eggs at least. some of the new features because like I said it's been a while since I've been on here and I've not I haven't even played Minecraft like not on the server so I really have not experienced mine closed due to being shit has lava though. <laughs> um yeah I haven't even tried out half of the new stuff um on a single player world. So this is going to all be pretty new to me. So which way? Okay, let's just. Oh, I keep my son down shift to try and run. I've been playing Borderlands. Um, or Borderlands 2. Yeah, got some pigs. Okay, so let's go. Do I have any armor? I do not have any armor. There's a fair amount of cows there. Cow Chaos Island. This one's loose. So I should deal with him. And let's go get some some leather. Let's go, come on. I'm gonna use up half my 
Oh, I freed that cow, but he's stupidly going back down. Right. Okay, since this is my cow farm, I'm going to leave it there. Don't particularly want to piss anyone off. So that's the sign. Go this way. Oh, there's a workbench. Sorry, I'm just going to go make some armor. Chest pieces are the best. So let's get that. And then we want some pantaloons. Yeah, and we want some booties. And then we want a helmet. Ah, awesome. Plenty of leather. I've even got some spare to make some more when I inevitably get attacked and lose it all. So, let's run. forest. Is this any ones in particular? Because I'm going to cut some down. Yeah, I'm the only one on. There's not... The server's kind of died down a bit since I used to be on it. The main issue really is the fact that most of the people on it were people from uh, my uni. And most of them have now got new jobs. Probably uh, half the people on the server have moved to a different country and are no longer in England and basically have got new jobs obviously in new places so they're not online. I got a new job and I moved town, I didn't move country so I've not had time to get on here. So the server's a bit quiet really, but that's kind of be to be expected. And, I mean, I have. I have a steady income, so I'm going to keep it open. I mean, steady income, not from from this, obviously, from having a job other than this, but it pays for this easily. It's only a very, very small server for, like, ten people. So, it's not not a big issue. I mean, I'm playing this and with, with just me it's running absolutely fine. There's no lag whatsoever. Well, I don't think I've seen any. So, it's no issue. I probably shouldn't be travelling at night. should probably go back and sleep in a bed. But, yeah, caution is for people who are cautious. So he said it was this way. Probably should have written down the coordinates. But never mind. Let's just go to find this the house. Is this the house? I don't know, it looks like a mine. There's no signs anywhere. There's a random sapling. Okay, yeah, this is definitely a mine. Let's go investigate. Uh, you need to make the ceiling higher. You ever built this? Yay! Oh. Right. Let's see what's down here. Random offshoots of death and danger. Okay, this looks like just some strip mining, so. There's no. Oh, it's gonna take it just to get back up. Um, um yeah, there's no no point in me coming down here and trying to mine because most of the good stuff around this little area will be taken. So I might as well go up and find somewhere else. Also I wanna carry on and try and find carpet birds. Whatever, unless this is it, but I was hoping it would have a sign this was it. Let's carry on. Da -da -da -da. Right. Okay. Oh. Deserts are never good. 
climb the tree. Oh, I have a bed. I didn't realize I had a bed. I bet, <laughs> I bet people, anyone who watches this is just screaming at me, going, "You have a bed, you idiot! Go to sleep!" I did not realize I had a bed. Yes, that's good. Any other iron or stone? No, this is my only stone tool. But wood is always useful, and to begin with, it's what my house will be made of, so having a good supply is nice. And I think. So the moment I'm gonna I'm gonna sleep. Apparently this version of craft bucket is out of date. So let's get my bed back. Let's get my wood back. And we carry on. Ooh. That's looking that's looking hills over there. Okay. This is quite um odd now. I um I got I've gotten used to FTL where there's there's always stuff going on. There's always there's always an enemy around the corner, something happening, a new ship or whatever. So you kind of don't have to think as much about what you're going to s talk about because you can talk about the game a bit more. But Minecraft, there's a lot more, a lot more getting places to do. So that's what I am going to do. Oh, I'm already level seven. I don't know what I started on. I think I was at, wasn't even level one when I started. So yeah, why did I not look? at um, the coordinates that guy that carpet bed put down because I have no idea how far away I am so I'm just going to keep wandering until I find a house of my own see I'm going to do that so if I need to make a shelter I can go this way don't particularly want to make a house on sand sand is an well if you want to dig down in sand it's a bit awkward because obviously you have to support everything otherwise it caves in on your face Oh, I think I've just seen where I want my house. I think at the top of that thing, right on the top, with a flat face out on this side, so it shows to anyone coming this way. So, let's go check in. Sheep. Climb, climb to the top. Let's try and climb to the top. Uh, yeah, a bit of parkour going on here. just there. Then I've got water down there. I've got grass and stuff down there. I've got animals down there. Got what looks like a big cave system. 
or a cave there which might lead to a system. Yep, this is where I am making my house. And if I, if I have the... I don't even have a crafting bench. Let's get a crafting bench. I haven't played Minecraft in so long, it's, it's weird. My fingers don't work quite right. Wow, you make three signs. That's new. And a big improvement as well. Signs used to be really expensive to make. Well, in comparison to what they actually give you, they were expensive to make. So, let's go... I think I'm going to have it at that level. So, dodge... pluses... house. This is the level I'm going to have that. So. Now I know some uh, pe like Minecraft people tend to take this stuff out of their video, but as I see it, if I have to do it, you should do it too. I mean, you, you have a little skip bar, so if you really want to skip it, you can. I can't. I have to do this myself. Part of Minecraft. It's almost the essence of Minecraft. Is the work you've got to put in. Okay. This shovel's gonna break soon. I'm gonna need to go down to that little hole cave thing underneath and get some stone. I like this place. No! It broke. Okay, so we're going to have to go down here. Ah, that's cool. It's a little passageway. Little lookout points. Nice, I like it. So let's gather enough stone. We only need a little bit. Don't need much. Okay, and then let's use the perfect working angle. Uh, it's how uh, craftsmen have worked for for decades. So let's do that. Should tie me over for a little bit. Uh, I won't get back up. There we go. Let's fill in this floor. There we go. mentioned the server and about how the, the reason why it's a bit lonely. Um, uh, I'm never going to get the fame of the floating block of ice. You are so magical. Um, right, what to talk about? I think this is quite good. I don't know whether I should square this off or leave it looking kind of natural as it is. Well, naturalish. I have hacked away an entire layer of it. A few layers, so it's not perfectly natural. But yeah. So right, I should probably well, since I should probably just do sort of a brief introduction, but I haven't gained any subscribers, so there wouldn't really be any point. I think people that... and I've made like 20 videos, it's not like it's difficult to go back and 
see the first video I did, although the first video I did, the quality is so bad on that thing, um, I wouldn't exactly be offended if no one watched it. Um, so I'll do a little introduction to who I am. So I am Matthew, and I uh, was a student, I studied uh, computer games programming, which I graduated uh, fairly recently from, and I have started work, uh, which is the reason for the sudden lack of videos for a while. I am working as a, not a developer, and it's not really support, it's more in the middle. I'm, yeah, though I suppose I am more support than development, but it's, it's more of a start. It's where you start, because you need to, you need to learn skills of how to use it in the development in the actual business and how it works, so that's where I am at the moment. It's alright, it's stressful at times when people are moaning at you and then six different people moan at you at once but I'm going to suggest that that's life really and I'm going to get used to it so I will and I have a bit although I still think I still think they're moaning a bit too much to heart but I'm sure the cynicism will cynicism? cynic? cynic? cynicalism? Cynicism will come in very, fairly soon, and I will not give a rat's ass what they think. So let's let's look forward to that day. And I haven't been really done that many of many videos. I mean, I'm still pretty new to it all. I still make stupid mistakes like bashing around my microphone while I'm recording uh, the last video accidentally coughing into the mic uh, <laughs> the in the FTL video where I accidentally quit to my desktop and it screwed up the recording in the last bit so I had to re-record I had to record an extra bit to add on the end to apologise for said random ending of the recording. But I think I'm getting better. Whoa, I almost just walked off the edge of the cliff. So let's start making this into a house. So I'm going to go around the edge I think. sign, you're in the way. What? I did not tell you to go there. So, um, yeah, my, some of my plans for the future, I suppose, would be something to talk about. Obviously, I'd like to, at some point, become a fully fledged software developer rather than uh, having a focus around support. That'd be quite nice, but that will be be a while still. At least another, I don't know, seven or eight months probably before I start to go that way. I don't know whether I'm going to stick with my job for that I currently have for years. It's good, I'll say it's decently paid, it's it's alright, I could have done a lot worse, but I don't think it will really get me going exactly sort of where I want to go and down the, yeah, I don't think it's as good for my career as it could be, so I want to get a bit of experience there 
something I can add to my CV and use and then go get a better job. But that's in the future. For now I'm just going to um, take the very professional start of winging it. Which is what I'm doing at the moment. So this is the base of my house, or the, the walls of my house. Should I build the layer of wood? Or should I do half slabs? Maybe I should do half slabs. Although, hmm, can you place items like this on a half slab now? Actually, I should, why don't I test it as a pressure plate? Do we need a crafting bench to make a half slab? Nope, that's a... Jungle wood slab. Okay, so there's a slab. So, let's see. Will it... No! Okay, that's what I feared. So... I'm not going to go with the half slab. Oh, the half slabs are actually um, broken using an axe now. It was always weird that it was better to hit it with an axe, uh, with a pickaxe, than it was with a, a wood axe, considering it's made of wood. Uh, oh, I've built this bottom layer out of jungle wood, and down there is not a jungle. So this is going to be the bottom layer, I think. But I'm going to have to. Um, use different wood to build on top I think possibly oak wood although that's not going to give me enough I don't think let's give it a try I can always get more oak wood so I just want it to kind of be too high so that it doesn't allow although most of the edge is surrounded anyway so it won't, shouldn't be too much of an issue but I feel a bit safer if it's a bit higher it feels it feels more homely let's put it that way let's put the jungle wood there okay let's put it And let's. I've, and yeah, let me put a disclaimer here. I have absolutely no idea if this is going to look any good. I'm just going with the flow. Slash using the materials I have at hand. Doesn't look too bad actually. So, I think what I'm going to do is make the floor out of jungle wood like that, that will be kind of to remind me I do with some more torches really but let's sleep and take another swig of cider that's the way to play Minecraft. Chocolate and cider. And all alone. Okay. So what I need to do is go down, but it's a bit of a bitch to get back up to my house at the moment. Um and I need some axes. So let's make some sticks and then make some axes like that and then work out where we want a door. Do we want a door here? This looks like the, probably the best place to have one.
I'm not being too precise with these with this at the moment because I'm gonna sort this out and make it a lot neater in time. So we go, that's our our entrance. And do we have enough wood for a door? We do have enough wood for a door. If I create this birch wood into a door like that. Uh, I've got too much stuff. Right. That looks ridiculous. That looks ridiculous. for the moment. So let's do that. Okay, that should give us a bit of safety. If I remember to close it. And let's make while I'm thinking about it. Double chest. Yeah. Oh, long winded way of doing that. So there we go. Now let's get uh, things that we don't need out of the way. Saplings, yep. Eggs, some wool. Nope, don't need that. Leather can stay here. A bit of beef. Um, need the sign. So, let's go. And, oops. Yep. The way up to my house is definitely a bit dangerous. It's not for the faint hearted. What wood's this? Spruce wood? What does it look like? It's like that. Ah, not too bad. Sort of dark, ominous wood. Cool. That's, I think that will make a lovely house. A lovely abode. Because this wood, obviously being the one closest to me, is going to be the mainstay of our house with all of our wood based activities so that's ok, I've cleared the wood out that way let's go here just do one, I want a good amount, these large trees are a bit, a bit awkward to deal with at least you can go on top of them like this and then you can just hack down at them and then get stuck in them but right, you find you with some dirt Right. And get 
some more wood. Basically, because this is the oh reeds. Got my own little reed farm. And I didn't even have to plant it. There we go. Good, good. So let's plant some more of these. There, 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 there. the most easily accessible reed farm in the world. But, okay. Hmm. It's a raw chicken. But chicken is never a particularly good thing to eat. So let's... Hmm. Yeah, I've got a lot of it so I can just eat. Get my health up to full. And then next time we go up you silent people of YouTube, apart from if you want to comment on the video, and then you're not silent, your voice is heard. Plug. Um, yes, you need to remind me to cook some stuff when I go back up to where my house is. Sheep. Ah, that's a very forward jump. Seem to have a little rocket boost. Away. I think it's at the top. That stupid thing. My wood. Give me my wood. Give me wood. There we go. So, this should soon be enough to do a couple of layers of our house, hopefully. Do this tree and then we'll go back up to my house. Okay. So get plenty of sap things if we can. So then we go up the nice and gentle thing to my house. Imagine if imagine if this is where you actually lived in real life and this is your way to way to get home. As you come home from a long day at work, and you're like, F come on, let me up the stupid, I want to go, just let me sleep in my own bed, you, Gah, come on, fuck, ah, I'm home, oh fuck, there's no roof, I think that kind of sums up the experience you would have if if this was your actual house. Oh yeah, that's plenty of planks. Oh yeah, I like this wood. It gives a... I think I said it before, but it's kind of a foreboding look. It's quite a dark wood. Like a varnished wood. Definitely could do with more torches though. Although I could probably solve that by making some charcoal. Which I might do, because I'm supposed to be cooking, aren't I? Oh yeah, because I can't cook without coal, unless I use wood I suppose. I've got plenty of it. Wood for all. a bit like um because ice cream sandwich things you get not the phone or, or the android operating system but like so that top layer would be chocolate and then this would be vanilla and this would be probably strawberry okay so let's build a staircase up because 
there, we're going to put this layer on. No. Please don't leave me piece of wood. No. Cutting him out of my will. Right. Let's go. And this is going to be the ceiling level. So, damn it. Yeah, so let's. I think I've, I should have enough. Oh, yeah, I've got plenty. I've even got some more spare. Well, I think I've got plenty. It looks like plenty, or it feels like plenty. Whether it's. Because my house isn't that big, so it shouldn't take that much. Although, I, I again, while I remember. Oven. Oven. That's what we need. can't cook. Can you use it to... Oh, you can use it to cook. Cool. That's fine. That means I can at least cook some food up. So, let's see where I've... I'm not really doing this very in a very ordered manner. And um, since it's kind of relevant, I've mentioned this a couple of times in other videos, but as I was mentioning that I'm, I did a course in uh, computer games programming, one of the things I am planning to do as a future project is to basically write a game and develop a game and record the process for YouTube and so you'll basically be able to watch as it develops. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it yet. It may be a case that I basically record without any audio the development part and then I kind of cr um, make audio afterwards to kind of explain what I'm doing or whether I kind of work out what I'm going to program so I've got it sort of working and then I actually record the part once I know what I'm doing or whether to re sorry about that whether to record just everything I suppose the phrase would be warts and all um, I am unsure at the moment I don't know currently I'm looking at just the the legal side of it because I'm employed with another company so I need to check whether I'm allowed to do, do it. I'm, there shouldn't be any problems as far as I'm aware but I just want to make sure I just need to it's taking a bit longer than I would like but that's of no one's fault particularly just people on holiday um, and I misplaced the copy of my contract but, uh, well, I think I know where it is. But um, it's not near me currently to check quickly, so I need to get a copy of it. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's sort of the big project I have lined up, and I'm planning that to be a... Um, a long running project so I'm not intending to start to develop and finish or plan develop and finish a game but I'd say within a month or whatever it will at least take a few months if not longer than that because I'll only probably be doing programming over the weekend and then I won't be doing incredible amount maybe 
two or three hours. I'm pr uh, I'll probably end up doing more as I get into the project because that's kind of how programming works. You start off and then you get really, really absorbed by it and then you've suddenly used all your weekend programming. But for the moment, that's kind of what I'm thinking is likely to happen. I haven't quite worked it out. I know and here's where it gets a little tricky is that I know what I want to make, I know the the genre which is uh, a tower defense game, that's what I want to make because I think it's something I would be able to do and although it's still going to be, be pretty difficult cause to do all of it myself um, I would like to try and but I can't really tell you much more at the moment because um, again for the legal issue I don't want to sort of say what I'm going to do and then I, I don't know I'm probably overreacting with it but I don't particularly want to say anything that might cause issues later on so I can't really tell you exactly what my plan is And I probably won't. Obviously, you'll be able to see the development as it goes on, and when I do sort of testing shots and tests to see if everything's working, you'll be able to see um, that as I go, so you'll be able to get a gist of what's happening. But depending on how I feel, um, it, the actual sort of uh, concept behind the game might be the right word. I, um, cause I'm, I've thought of something which I've not really seen done so much, which I would like to try and see see what it's like. But I don't particularly want to say that now, in case someone who's better or has a team of people decide, oh that is a good idea, I'm going to take that and then they obviously make it far quicker than me, they make it better than me and then I'm just a person who's copying them so for that reason really I am sort of keeping under wraps the exact nature and specifics of what I'm going to make but you will see the bits and near the end once I actually have something more tangible I will sort of not so much reveal because you'll, you'll probably guess anyway after a while of what I'm thinking but yeah and it adds a bit of mystery you'll be like what game is he making this is craziness so that's kind of a very brief, well, probably not brief, it's probably about an hour I've been yabbering on. But again, uh, professionally, I've not, not bothered to look at the time whatsoever, so I have no idea how long this video is. Professional, professionalism, that's my motto. Uh, although, just then, I struggle to pronounce professionalism. So, I think, now that we're actually a bit safe, uh, in, our, in the lollipop house, or the ice cream house, I am going to say goodbye, and, um... Uh, if you hopefully um, in future videos we can do a bit more and hopefully other people will be on so we can interact with them and have some fun uh, and some anecdotes anecdotes I think that's the right word I'm looking for I'm running out of ability to use English at the moment
Even that sentence wasn't particularly good. Right, um, no, that's not how you make a bow. A bow is... Is that a bow? No, it's... What is a bow? Is, is the bow... Oh, well, hold on. I think I'm being an idiot. No, what is the bow? I thought it was that. Or is it... Yeah, oh yeah, that makes sense because the wood is curved and... Ay, 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 ay. It's not going so well for my brain. Right, I don't have any flint, so I can't make any arrows. But I will say this is the end of the episode. And thank you for watching. Um, hopefully, I can bring you more Minecraft as well as more FTL and uh, the development project when I can get round to that everything is cool with it so if you like this video please click like and if you want to say something interesting and important or even if you don't feel free to comment I'm always interested to read them it's not like I have many to read so I'll always get around to reading them and uh, if you want to see more please subscribe and I think that's about it so again thank you for watching and I will see you next time Bye-bye.